They're so pink and cuddly though. I don't see anything zombarific about them. Let's go up here and grab ourselves a Spears Orb. Very, very nice that we get that already. Just right out of the bat. And then I thought that was a door, but it was not. Uh, we're up against more Dark Ninja. You know, that's the only way to put it. Those are stained glass, by the way. And we chuck them. It didn't even seem like we did any damage after we chucked them. But down he goes eventually. And we're up against these guys again. These guys, we've been taking them on for what seems like forever. Wizard eyes, weepy eyes. We've been taking them on. No difficulty there. Up to level 40 for for Jake. We should be getting uh, levels up for everybody else very, very quickly here. Usually one enemy separates the level ups for everybody. Uh, we could get both, though. Yeah, there we go. Level 40 for everybody. And head down here, take on more very cute-looking wolf zombies. I don't, I don't understand. Uh, you keep on using the word zombie. I do not think it means what you think it means. Let's just shake that open and not grab a chocolate. Did not purchase a cup of wishes now that I think about it. Did need to buy one of those. Haven't needed to use it though. And it is boss time. We're up against another zombie tiger. This one is, uh, well, another spiky tiger, I should say. Uh, this one is a uh, blue spike. He's not particularly weak to any magic. Uh, you can't. Uh, chain cast him though. Can I? I can't. Okay, so what I, I looked up chain casting again uh, because I don't think I was doing it right. Uh, what you want to do is not. Um, okay. Is not use uh, the character that you have on. Uh, you don't want to use your character that you are. How do I want to phrase this? You don't want to use uh, your character and go through the menu that way. Uh, what you want to do is uh, have somebody else selected. And I, I already messed up one of them. There we go. Nope. Back to you. Uh, you want to use the other person's menu button, uh, which is X in, for the Super Nintendo. I believe this was released on the virtual console, so you, know, you have to change it, change your button configuration accordingly. Still nothing. Come on. There we go. I think one more should be good. And then, yeah, because of uh, how much damage it does, remember there's the limit as of uh, 999 on chain casting. I believe... I'm not sure if that actually helps with the chain casting, but that is what I am told, that it works better if you're not using uh, the character that you have selected, that you use, uh, you go through the, the allies menu screen instead of your normal menu screen, that should help with the chain casting. But once again, uh, I'm not a big fan of it, uh, you know, just enough so that, how dare you, I will chain cast the shit out of you because you did that. We're going to do uh, Gem Missile here because I like Gem Missile. I'm not exactly sure why. But, yeah, it's, I think it works fairly nicely just using my own menu that way. And then, of course, with Jake adding in some punches here and there, it makes this fairly easy. But that should be enough. That should be plenty. We're not doing that much damage to it, but down it finally goes. Down goes Blue Spike. Wait, no. I swore he, he was doing the the I'm dying phase, but it looked like he was just doing the I'm getting hit by magic phase. That is not that cool. How dare you do that to me, Blue Spike. How much HP does he have? He's, we should be getting really close to finishing him off here, actually. Unless I somehow glitched him out. I swore we have done enough. Yeah, you can't hit him while he's up there. Could you guys hit him, please? How did that miss? Fireball! No! Yeah, uh, wait, can I hit him from up here? Maybe? How is nobody hitting him? I'm gonna have to heal. <laughs> 17 damage. This guy is not that difficult. Yeah, we should have done more than enough damage to finish him off now. Now I'm just starting to get... Starting to get a little nervous that I might have glitched the system. 
Like, seriously, we should have done enough to finish him off now. Between all those gem missiles I casted, and how much damage we're doing here, especially when we start whacking them. Acid bubbles! No! How are you guys missing it? Like, would it help if you guys were up here? Once again, the gloves are not helping me out at all. Why do I even level these up? I'm sure there's a good reason for it somewhere along the line, but not encountering it today. Let's try to level up Undyne a little bit. Now that he's down, though, now that I could do damage, I'm being held back by fucking... Ugh. Can't get up there. Can't punch him from the top. This is not cool. Moogle Glare! How dare you? Fine, I'm chain casting your ass again. Actually, just one more hit should be more than enough, I would think. Now he goes down. Thank you. Just took one more magic. Down goes Blue Spike. Thank you. Thought I had already done this, though. Give me whatever orb I have coming to me, because that took longer than it should have. And we got the boomerangs orb. For that, we can level that up again. And it has opened up a path just in the middle of the freaking room. Did not expect that. So let's head up. We can grab another chest. Of course, this is a tower, so we're pretty much going to be going up a lot. We can get an axe orb out of that. Nothing here. So let's just keep going. Oh, there is something here. There's a zombie there. It's such a cute little zombie, though. I, I want to pet the zombie. I don't think they'll let me do that, though. So apparently you can punch zombies to death, though, too. Didn't realize you could do that. Why haven't we leveled up the... Well, even if we do level up the uh, the gloves, I'll have to level it up again because we, we got the orb already. We should be doing more damage, but it doesn't look like we are, really. Just keep hitting him. There we go. Down it goes. Now we can head down here, take on more of these guys. Ah, uh, I've already forgotten their names. I think they're like Emberman. Yeah, Emberman. Don't like these guys, but they go down real fast, so I can't complain too much about them, but I can always complain about something. Let's just head up, and it is boss time yet again. We're up against the Gorgon Bull. You might recognize him uh, from when we had taken on his, well, Minotaur buddy before. This guy, once again, not very easy to hit with the charged up uh, regular attacks. So, fully understandable if you just use the, uh, yeah, I'm unconscious apparently, if you use the regular attacks on him. Alright, we do need to heal though, that we do need to do. Uh, he is weak to Thunderbolt, once again, just like the uh, Minotaur is, but I sh don't think I need to use it against him, I probably will go for that eventually, just to save him time, in fact, let's go for that now. I don't have very much of it though. Uh, we need to go for Thunderbolt so I only can do two of those before I need to use um, Fairy Walnut. Oh shit, do you see how much damage that did? Yeah, use that all day. Where's my. Where's my walnut? Eat a walnut. Shit, I didn't realize he was that weak to it. Would have been doing that from the beginning. This is gonna make this fight ridiculously easy. Go Thunderbolt. Just spam the shit out of it until he's dead. Once again, yeah, it might help if you go might help you go a little bit faster if you use somebody else on the menu. And then use the ally menu button. But this is this is working fine for me. And down he goes, and I wasted one of the Thunderbolts, but I don't really care, because down goes the Gorgon Ball. He's really weak to Thunderbolt. Yes, we did it! Way to go! Way to go! And what orb did we get this time? We got the Bose Orb! Very nice, I'll probably I need to level that up as well. And we can continue going up the tower. I do believe that was the last boss, though! It was! And here we find another spirit! Who do we have here? I'm Lumina! The king was robbing me of my power! He was forcing me to make gold! 
My power should not be used by anyone but you. Take my powers before evil engulfs us all. Surely I will do that. And we get Lumina's powers. Very, very nice. But we also get another mana seed here, number six. So now that we now we have that, we can level everything up to level six. I'm sure you guys understand. We also got all our HP back. Of course, since it's Lumina and it's kind of like a holy type magic, Shion can use it. We can of course, equip our saber with it, which is always nice. Uh, we can also do a lucent beam, which is actually an attack. Holy crap, she can use an attack. Uh, and lucent barrier, which does buff your defense. And now Yancey can't use it. Once again, I think they're going for a symbolism here uh, with Lumina and Shade, very similar to Wisp and Shade uh, with uh, Sword of Mana with uh, Lumina, of course, since it's a white element, I guess you could say only the white mage could use it, whereas the black element in shade, once again using loose terminology here, uh, can only be used by the black mage. And we are pretty much done here, so I think we can actually use the magic rope to get out of here. Very, very short dungeon, I must say. Not much to it. And we need to head out this way. So I think we are, I think we're done. Can we, can we go talk to the king? Does the king have anything new to say? Now we've taken away his ability to make more gold. That is kind of important, I would think. I do need to buy another walnut and a couple wishes, but outside of that, I think we are pretty much done here. How you doing, buddy? He doesn't have anything new to say. We took away his ability to make more gold, and he doesn't even freaking notice. What the hell? What the hell? Okay, so. We need to... Well, I need to stock up on items and rest at the end. And then we can call Flammy and continue our way forward. Because we didn't even find Jock here. But you forgot about him, didn't you? I didn't. Fully stocked on items. Healed. Rested. Saved. Ready to go. Let's use our drum. Because we need to head back to the lofty mountains. Because Sage Jock wasn't there. So let's try to find out where he is. We need to go southwest more or less in order to get this done. Uh, giant mountain range. That is what we are looking for. This one right here. Unfortunately, they won't let me land right at the top, but this is pretty much the way that we need to go. Yet again, we can check with Nico if he decides to spawn this time. Uh, also, a great spot for level grinding uh, right here because these enemies do give out decent amounts of experience and money and all that kind of stuff. We use Drain on me. Holy crap! See that shot? Hit all three of them with one punch. Thank you. Weapon skill up. Closer reach in level five, which makes them more effective. However, we need to get them to level six because that is what we have available to us. Is he up here? No. No, he's, he's further on need to head back up and since this is something that well, we've only seen once I'm, I'm gonna keep this on screen uh, should we happen to go through this again I'll probably cut it out after this though because I know this can be quite annoying and there's not that much in terms of difficulty here not very much indeed level 41 now is always nice everybody up so that we can take them out Yancey not Shion no just Yancey. You're still working on the whip, right? Yeah. Let's get over there. 